Mr. Plinkett doesn't hold back on his recently released Star Wars. The Last Jedi Review, directed and written by Ryan Johnson. The latest episodic film in the famed space opera earned an impressive $1.3 billion at the global box office. But while many loved it thanks to its bold storytelling that cracked the lore open, it also gained criticism from the massive fan community, making it one of the most controversial blockbusters in recent years. Since its release back in December, the film has been a favorite topic of conversation online. Sadly, not all discussions have been civil. Things got a little bit too intense that keep people behind the project have been the subject of online harassment. The latest incident resulting in franchise newbie Kelly Marie Tran deleting her Instagram. Luckily, the majority of the fandom has stepped up and strongly denounced the practice. Related, Star Wars Kelly Marie Tran responds to online harassment campaign eight months after The Last Jedi hit theaters. Red Letter Media's Mr. Plinkett has released his review of the movie. The video clocks in at almost an hour, which is interestingly shorter than his Star Wars. The Force Awakens commentary, with the internet personality sifting through the whole film, from its writing, all the way to its visuals. He even included deleted scenes and clips from the movie's home entertainment featurettes. He, however, devoted more attention in dissecting some of the movie's most popular criticisms and compared it to both Star Trek and the gold standard of Star Wars movies and sequels in general. The Empire Strikes Back. Watch the entirety of Mr. Plinkett's review in the video below. It's important to note, however, that this meta and brutal kind of reaction is what Mr. Plinkett has always been known for. So it's best to not take it that seriously regardless of how one feels about The Last Jedi. Those who thoroughly enjoyed the movie might feel frustrated with the level of nitpicking of the online personality, while those who weren't impressed by Episode 8 will more likely feel validated by his comments. But at the end of the day, Everyone has the right to their opinions. And whether one liked the movie or not, people should always respect each other. The video should definitely not be used to bully anyone. Especially those who actually worked tirelessly on the film as Sir Johnson is taking the backseat. In terms of the franchise's main saga, he's still developing a separate trilogy. With The Force Awakens, director J.J. Abrams returning to helm and co-write, with Chris Terrio, Star Wars, Episode 9, Principal Photography recently started, while the film's casting sheet continues to be filled out, with how Star Wars, The Last Jedi left things for both the Resistance and the First Order. It's quite difficult to gauge how the sequel trilogy Capper will go down, but with more than a year away before it hits theaters. Fans can expect more information about the narrative coming out in the next several months. Source. Red Letter Media. YouTube Tags. Star Wars. Star Wars 8.